Hi, welcome to Tag Arcade. Uh, so if you find any of my tutorials helpful, uh, go ahead and click on uh, this nice little uh, button on the top right hand corner of my website, www.tagarcade.com. Uh, so in my last tutorial, we just finished installing Unity 3D and ran Hello World just to make sure everything functions properly on the Mac. Now we're going to go ahead and do the same thing, but for the iPhone. Uh, so in order to do that, we first have to go and open the App Store and download Xcode. Uh, my recommendation is before you download Xcode, go into Updates and make sure that there's no updates that you need for your computer. If there are, you should install those first before you go ahead and download Xcode. Once those are finished installing, go ahead and search for Xcode on the top right hand corner and click on install. Okay, so once that happens, that install is going to go down into your dashboard and we're going to click it up and wait for it to finish downloading. As always, I'm going to go ahead and speed through this download process. Yay, and Xcode finish installing. Uh, so let's go ahead and start running a Unity 3D. So let's go to my applications, go down to Unity. And since we'll be creating games a lot, I want to move uh, Unity into my dock down here for easy access. Uh, so the first thing we're going to do is reopen up our uh, Hello World application, which we called Template. So let's go ahead and wait for Template to open up. And once it does, we'll go to File, Build Settings, and select iOS. Let's go ahead and build this. We'll call this... Uh, Let's actually move this to a different location. So here, I'm going to create a new folder called Xcode. Create. And I'm just going to call this Hello World. Hit Save. And that should build my Xcode project. Okay, now that that's done, let's go ahead and open up our Xcode program. Okay, so we agree to this thing. And let's go ahead and type in the computer password. And I guess Xcode has to finish installing some components. Okay, so it looks like Xcode is finally launching. Come on, Xcode, launch, launch, open. Okay, so what we're going to do is we are going to do file, open, 
and we're going to browse to our documents directory, our Xcode, and hello world. Let's go ahead and open our project. And let's go ahead and build it to our iPhone. So you want to enable developer mode on this Mac? Yes, I do. So let's go ahead and type in our computer password once again. And I am busy processing symbols. Uh, so let's go ahead and wait for this to finish processing the symbol files. Okay, so we're at indexing processing files. <laughs> Let's go ahead and try to run this again. See what happens. So why did the build fail? Let's see. Uh, signing for Unity iPhone requires the development team. Please select the development team. So let's go ahead and go to Xcode preferences and look at our accounts. So currently we have no accounts. So we have to go ahead and add an Apple ID. So hopefully you guys already signed up for a developer account in order to produce uh, iPhone and iPad apps. So if you haven't done so already, just go open up Safari and go to developer.apple.com and sign up for your account. Uh, in order to produce an iPhone and iPad app, I believe you have to pay $99. Uh, once you do that, then you go here and add the account. Uh, since I have already have an account, I've actually saved this information onto a USB, uh, USB drive. So I am going to simply import my developer account. Uh, so let's go to my USB drive and import that in. Otherwise, you would have clicked on that plus symbol that you saw earlier. And uh, click on the plus sign you saw earlier. And then um, it would, sorry, you would click on the plus sign that you saw earlier. Sign in with your username and password and get the account. So there we go. We I imported my account successfully. So let's go ahead and try this again. Play. And why did my build fail again? So let's go to click on iPhone. And add accounts. I already have an account. Okay, so it looks like there's something with my account. Maybe. Let's go all the way back to preferences. Okay, so it looks like the 
uh, the account has not been signed in, so let's go ahead and sign in. We try. And there we are. So let's go ahead and hit play. No? Still not a good time. Uh, media at tagarcade.com. Okay, the count is all good. Okay, so I guess we gotta close sex code and try again. Okay, finally. Let's go ahead and select my certificate. Okay. And let's go ahead and run this. Okay, let's go ahead and always allow. And it looks like it's loading on the iPhone. And after all that trouble, we finally get Hello World on the iPhone. Ah, so there was a lot of waiting and fixing errors, but that's the whole point of Hello World, is that uh, you build a very simple application, uh, work through all the little bugs and kinks, so that when you finally produce your big game, hopefully it will compile a whole lot faster than uh, what just happened. Uh, so if you like what you see, like, subscribe, and all that good stuff. And until next time, have fun and keep on creating games.